During February, the RDN monitoring team detected sexism, religious and ethnic discrimination and homophobia. In Montenegro, an anti-Muslim fresco was discovered in the recently repaired and repainted Orthodox Church in majority Muslim community Rojaje. In Bosnia and Herzegovina, portal Clicks Ba reported on the new head of the cabinet of the Deputy Minister of Transport and Communications by reducing her to her appearance in a music video. On K1 television in Serbia, TV host Gordana Nagoca Tržan spread problematic statements regarding harassment in public places, promoting the idea that catcalling is a form of flattery. In Kosovo, a member of the parliament of the Alliance for the Future of Kosovo, Albana Butuci, told online media in Sarderi that she would not be voting for the civil code, which resulted in homophobic, anti-LGBTQ plus comments and hate speech. In Albania, the investigative journalism show Stop reported on a rape case by interviewing both the perpetrator and victim, in which highly insensitive and disturbing questions were directed at the young girl. In North Macedonia, journalist Milenko Nedelkovski published a tweet which was both discriminatory and hateful towards the Albanian people in the country. Reporting Diversity Network continues to monitor media representation of diversity and urges media to adhere to ethical and professional standards.